Welcome to the journey through time, where we unravel the mysteries of the ancient world. Today, we find ourselves in Mesopotamia, the cradle of civilization. This remarkable region, nestled between the Tigris and Euphrates rivers, gave rise to some of the world's earliest civilizations. From the innovative Sumerians to the ambitious Babylonians, these ancient societies laid the groundwork for modern culture, politics, and technology. Mesopotamia, the land between two rivers, nurtured the seeds of the modern world. Imagine a time when the world's first cities were taking shape. This was the reality during the rise of the Mesopotamian city-states, a pivotal period in human history. These city-states, each with its own ruler and deities, were independent entities, often warring for power and resources. Yet it was within the walls of these city-states that the seeds of civilization truly started to flourish. Let's take a moment to consider the Sumerians, the earliest urban dwellers we know of in Mesopotamia. Their lives were a blend of innovation and tradition. They developed systems of irrigation, crafted intricate jewelry, and even brewed their own beer. But perhaps their most significant contribution was the cuneiform writing system, the world's first form of written communication. These wedge-shaped marks pressed into clay tablets allowed them to record everything from business transactions to epic tales of gods and heroes. The rise of city-states marked a turning point in human history, setting the stage for complex societies. In the heart of Mesopotamia, laws were written and towers reached for the heavens. One of the most significant of these laws was Hammurabi's Code, one of the earliest known legal systems. This comprehensive code, etched into stone, provided a stable framework for society, ruling everything from trade disputes to criminal punishments. Yet mysteries surround this ancient legal system. How was it enforced? What impact did it have on the everyday life of an ordinary Mesopotamian citizen? Simultaneously, Mesopotamians were constructing monumental architecture ziggurats. These massive structures built to reach the heavens were more than just buildings. They were symbols of the city's devotion to their patron deity. Yet questions linger around these towering edifices. What engineering techniques did the ancient Mesopotamians use? What was the true purpose of these ziggurats? Hammurabi's code and the towering ziggurats are testaments to the grandeur of Mesopotamian civilization. Numbers ruled the world then, just as they do now. Let's delve into the intriguing world of Sumerian mathematics and its impact on trade and commerce. The Sumerians were pioneers in the field of mathematics, developing a complex system based on the number 60, which has influenced our timekeeping and geometry to this day. They harnessed this knowledge to create detailed trade records, manage their economy and even map the stars. But like a math problem that stumps even the brightest students, mysteries surround their mathematical prowess. How did they come to choose the number 60 as the basis of their system? What led them to the discovery of complex geometric principles? And perhaps most importantly, how did they apply this knowledge to their everyday lives and their bustling trade networks? As we ponder these questions, one thing is clear. The Sumerians' understanding of mathematics laid the foundation for modern economic systems. Their legacy is a testament to the enduring power of numbers. All great things must come to an end. As the sun set on the zenith of Mesopotamia, factors like invasions, climate change and political instability began to gnaw at its foundations. External forces such as the ruthless Assyrians and Persians swept through the region, while internally, the once fertile lands grappled with severe droughts. Political discord added fuel to the fire, leading to the inevitable decline and fall of this remarkable civilization. The fall of Mesopotamia marked the end of an era, but its legacy continues to shape our world. Our journey through ancient Mesopotamia draws to a close, but the mysteries remain. We've ventured into the cradle of civilization, witnessing the rise of city-states, the pioneering legal code of Hammurabi, and the towering ziggurats. We've delved into the fascinating world of Sumerian mathematics and trade, and contemplated the factors that led to the end of this remarkable civilization. Yet the enigmatic allure of Mesopotamia persists, with questions still echoing through the millennia, unanswered. What secrets lie within the cuneiform inscriptions yet to be translated? What truths about the hanging gardens of Babylon are lost to time? And how did Mesopotamian society organize their trade and commerce? These questions invite us to delve deeper, to continue our exploration into this cradle of civilization. They remind us that history is a living, breathing entity, forever evolving as we unearth new discoveries. Thank you for joining us on this journey. 
Please like, share, and subscribe for more explorations into the past. Until next time, keep questioning and keep exploring.